case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The crux of the case revolved around a theft from a commercial parking garage that led to a battle inside the courtroom. The setting took place in the Hyatt Regency Nashville Hotel's car park, where a man found his car missing from the spot where he previously left it. Shaken, he demanded compensation from the garage owner for the loss of his vehicle. Frustrated by the owner's dismissal, he took the matter to the court. The story began a few hours prior, when the man parked his car in the defendant's garage. The garage, having only a single entry and exit, was open to the public. The plaintiff had received a parking ticket and left the garage with the keys in his possession. Upon discovering the loss, he initiated legal proceedings against the defendant, arguing that the owners bore responsibility for his stolen vehicle. In the initial proceedings, the lower courts ruled in the plaintiff's favor. The defendant contested this angle, arguing they were only providing a space for parking and should not be held liable for any incidents of theft. Despite the defendant's protestations, the court upheld the lower court's decision. Thus, the owners were indeed liable for the theft, failing in their contractual obligation to safeguard the vehicle. However, the decision wasn't unanimous as two justices voiced dissenting opinions. The final verdict upheld the decision of the lower courts and painted a picture. Parking garage owners bear a duty of reasonable care to protect the vehicles that reside in their premises. The case was then remanded for more proceedings as necessary. As the dust settled on this pivotal ruling, the scenario presented a stark reminder for commercial garage owners about their duty of care and potential ramifications in case of negligence. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law. Elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class.